Good morning. Tim Stanley, Blackout EZ, doing another segment with RVing with Tim. Here at the Barnyard RV Park here in Lexington, South Carolina. Came in on Saturday, leaving out today. It's Monday morning. My daughter had a football game to cover at a local university on Saturday. She's a sideline reporter for ESPN, so we came down to support her. And you know, if we can go in the RV, that's what we're going to do. So it's a nice park, good sand park, and it has a flea market as well that's open on the weekends, Saturday and Sunday. And yesterday, Sunday, was, although it was raining, it was very busy, and it was very busy on Saturday as well. So that's an activity you can do while you're here. Now, it's definitely a uh, uh, stopover park. It's not a destination park, but we're going to talk about it some more. All right, as you come in to the right, they have a dog park. So I saw a lot of people walking the dogs, so it's very pet friendly. And they have a, uh, look like a horseshoe uh, pit as well. But nicely landscaped and well maintained. It's very clean uh, RV park. And like I said, it is a good sand park with good ratings, okay? And very big flea market. What you see right there is a very small part of it. It's huge. Okay, this is the front office where you register. So you go around to the right and then pull around the building. I'm going to pan on around. They do have long-term RV storage right there in the back of the RV park. But I'm going to show you more of this flea market, how big it is. And it goes on beyond the camera. It is really huge. And they have their own concession stand and everything. So if you're in that, you can come on to the barnyard flea market. That's uh, right beside the barnyard RV park. All right, we're here at the front office. Uh, to the left, you see the entrance way and you see the uh, flea market. And to the right, you see the RV park and the RVs. All right, let's go inside, see what they have. Okay, we're here at the uh, front office and I told you they're a good sand park, so they're highly rated. Uh, very helpful staff and you see they have a lot of stuff that you always need I already purchased some toilet paper but seems uh, I told you my RV must eat it up but anyway they have uh, plugs and hoses and stuff you know everything that go wrong or you seem to leave at home you have to buy each RV trip so I'm gonna swing around uh, show you so they have free coffee uh, TVs and snacks and all that so very nice park very nice office and like I said it was very helpful and it is a good sand park and comes highly rated and you have over you have 129 sites right yes all right good deal thank you, thank you. okay opposite the front office they have a meeting room and a pretty nice facility so we're gonna go inside and take a look at it okay this is inside the meeting room so Pretty nice facility, so if you need to have a meeting or you have an event here in, uh, in Lexington, South Carolina, or, you know, in Columbia, um, and get your friends together. But anyway, have a nice facility, like a nice banquet facility, refrigerator, microwave, sink, and all that. So, uh, and also in the back, that, uh, if you go through that door, it leads out to a patio there on the right, and it leads out to a patio, and it has a... Uh, Nice open area, like a kind of a veranda out there. So very nice and uh, have a large screen TV as well. On the opposite end of the uh, front office, they have a laundry facility, one of two on site. One, they have another one all the way in the back of the RV park. So we're gonna go take a look. The washroom is not very uh, big, but it's big enough to do what you have to do. And they got four washers in there and they have uh, four dryers and it's very clean as a pen um, this is almost like a stopover park I see a lot of people coming in here uh, for one night and stuff and uh, leaving out so they have everything you need for washing your clothes on a long trip and uh, it's very clean okay they have a, a washroom on site as well and uh, this is the front so it has a uh, a lot of sinks and a lot of stalls and it has a uh, shower facility look like that one is handicap accessible it's very big 
and you have a standard one. So nice facility, it feels good in here, and it's also very clean. So this is the uh, men's room, of course. And so if you need to be outside the RV or you tent camping, or if for uh, any other reason you have to come in here, it's very clean and spacious and well lit. Okay, there's another view of the picnic area and the playground up front. Swing around and here's the uh, RV park. You know, all the sites are pull in. Some are dirt and gravel like that. And I'm on row space G2 right there. And it is asphalt and paved. Very nice, very level. I have new uh, hookup for the cable this part has the best cable i ever seen i had espn1 espn2 had all the disney channels you wouldn't expect it but it was great so the best cable ever was at this park now i'm in site g2 and they had brand new cable hookups now in the front they have a lot of transient campers you know like me coming in for a couple of days but in the back they are uh long termers and you can tell you see they've been there a while and that's all the way in the back on each row. Um, so it's a very nice park, but it does have a lot of, in the back, have a lot of um, long-term, long-term campers. And uh, you can just tell it, it is. But anyway, very nice park. Good sand rated, high, high ratings. Very quiet, man, it's spacious, it's clean. And uh, that's all you can ask for. And um, all the bathrooms have codes to get into. The laundry room as well. And uh, I mean, definitely a stopover park. Uh, saw a lot of Florida plates and out of town plates, you know, people passing through with the RV for the night, for the weekend, but excellent park to do that. All right. There go my unit right there. All right. RV with Tim out, Lexington, South Carolina, right outside of Columbia. I'm at Barnyard campground.